Carrington Dayuko here. We've got a Yugo open today. We've got the Hero Strike Elite Edition inside here. We have a structure deck of the new hero deck. And you get a playmat and some card dividers. And I priced this on eBay and Amazon is about £15. Whereas obviously the normal deck is about £8, £9. So you pay the extra money for the playmat mostly. If you, if, you, if you think it's worth it or not. We'll see when I open it. Plus you can also, I think you can sort the cards in this box. Depends how it opens. But either way it's a nice little set. And we'll see what inside the full cards and I think we get. Side. Put that there. There's that there. There's card dividers. Some cool artwork on them. Put this off to the side. We've got the play mat. Obviously, usually these can retail from I think ten pound onwards. I've seen them, just depending. So if you had that in the price of the deck, you are getting your money's worth. Put that to the side now. Nothing else in there. So I've got a deck. New deck with heroes and obviously nice heroes. Contrast Hero Chaos, yep. Mast Hero Koga, Mast Hero Divine Wind, Mast Hero Dark Law, and Omen to Hero Shadow Mist. There for the holographics, and then we'll go through the rest of the deck. And one card we haven't got in here is a amateur uh, burst in tricks. of hero but not the hero card it goes from we've also got just a common version of Red Tornado but then we've got regions so Overall, I believe this is a good deck, especially if you like going into Heroes and you've watched GX. I'd buy this in if I didn't use it, I'd buy it just for the cards and just for the nostalgia factor. But it's a good set, especially if you factor in the play mat you get. Quick look at that again. I'm not sure if this is out everywhere because I've, I've only seen it and I've heard it's only out in the UK. But I would check your local websites and stuff to make sure. But again, thank you for watching and see you next time.